Hey everyone, this is Vicki from Messy Table Studio. The video today is going to be a pretty short one, less than 20 minutes. And it is based on my love for black and white art and doodling. So the sources for a lot of them where I put Suzanne McNeil's name on the bottoms of them comes from a series of her Zentangle books that I have owned for many years now. I took a class with her oh my goodness, more than 10 years ago in Virginia Beach. And it was just a basic Zentangle class. And then I started buying her books. So a lot of them, a lot of the patterns I show in there on the little ATC cards come from the back of the book. And I have a series of eight, and I know she has more than that, but I stopped at number eight. So there's my source for Suzanne McNeil. Another source on them will be Yoga for Brain, Totally Tangled Edition um, by Sandy Steen Bartholomew, Bartholomew. And both these people are CZTs or Certified Zentangle Teachers. I took some of the inspiration for the, um, the small cards that are um, done with black backing on them from this deck of cards. And... Sorry, the dogs are barking at some imaginary thing. And then the last thing is the ATCs that I did for 30 days with Art Joya Sharing for 2021. And I made this pocket book to hold all my cards. And there are 30 cards because it was 30 days. And I photographed all of my cards and put black backing on them and then wrote the name of the Zentangle as best I could remember from the books on the back of the cards. And that's where you'll see the references where it says uh, Suzanne McNeil on it. They were taken from this book and put on these cards. Anything else comes from Rebecca Blair. Rebecca Blair. Yeah, Rebecca, Rebecca Blair. And then um, Pinterest, Instagram, and Flickr, as best I can remember. And some of it was my own imagination. The sad thing is, is when I made these things, I did not document where I got the majority of them from. So I've spent the last three hours going back, trying to look to give credit to the authors of the pictures that came off of Pinterest, Instagram, Flickr, and places like that. So you will see those credited to the authors where I could remember a source or find the source. If you want to look at other places where I stored those kinds of things in Pinterest, uh, the two main categories where that art is stored is in my Doodles collection, which has either six or eight other files under Doodle. And then the next one is Sketchbook. And that's where I stored a lot of things I found on the internet on how to draw flowers and how to do black and white doodling, that kind of stuff. So. That's it. I will see you guys in the next video. I hope the music is appropriate for the art. And I do appreciate you guys watching. So if you could give me a like, a comment, that would be lovely. Thanks, everyone. I hope you enjoy the video. Bye.
I forgot one book as I was putting all the other stuff away and cleaning off my desk. This was the book that started the whole thing for the Art Joy Sharing ATC 30 Day. Um, I don't know if the word challenge is appropriate, but anyway. Um, this is the book that I did a lot of the stuff out of along with the Suzanne McNeil books. It's called One's Entangle a Day and her name is Rebecca... Ooh, I'm going to crucify her name. Krahala. Krahala. K-R-A. Krahula. H-U-L-A. Anyway, so what this is, this is a six weeks course where you are challenged to use these, all these different things in here. Every day has a different challenge on it. You keep adding another element to it. And a lot of the stuff that's in... Um, in the video are things that I did day by day through the book. I didn't follow it exactly the way it said to do it, but I did the best that, you know, I could with the ability that I have. And some of the stuff was, uh, I don't know, I didn't really like it or I didn't like my results or I thought it was beyond what I could understand with my hand and brain. So anyway, I did a lot of stuff out of this book and I forgot to give this woman credit and I would like I want to add this on as an addendum to the video to say that um, this is a really good book if you want to challenge yourself. This is a great book to have in your arsenal. Okay, that's it. Now the video is really over. <laughs> Bye.